Welcome back to Lobotomy Corporation. I'm Romasta, and today we have a special abnormality. It requires three different abnormalities to be in your facility. Big Bird, Judgment Bird, which is down here, and Punishing Bird. You have to have two of them escape at the same time to start the event. The best suggestion I have before you actually start the fight, before you do this, is to organize your people by varying types of damage into different departments. Once it starts, a long time ago in a warm and dense forest lived three happy birds. All of them will escape. You want to make sure to have nobody really in the path of Big Bird, because Big Bird will go through your facility and proceed to darken everything it's in and call in people into its mouth. Judgment Bird will just walk around killing your employees. First thing that happens is the doorway opens up, which all the birds walk towards. Longbird weighed the sins of the creatures that entered the forest to keep peace. Longbird's scales could measure every sin and were fair and just. The doorway changed to a different thing upon the entering of Judgment Bird. Each time a bird enters, it changes. When Punishing Bird enters, Little Bird decided to punish bad creatures with his beak. And there, it adds an, another piece to the eye. Upon Big Bird entering, Big Bird with his many eyes watched over the forest to seek trespassers. Big Bird's eyes could see very far, and things we can't see. In Canada, cries of fear, somebody shouted, It's the monster! Big, terrible monster lives in the dark, black forest! And eggs proceed to show up around the map where you have to take out based on certain weaknesses. So this one is black, so we need all these people down here to come take out this. And then we have another egg down here, okay. This is weak to white damage. So these guys are all white damage. They need to come down and take care of that egg. We have to watch for the actual apocalypse bird coming into the room. And there should be one more egg as well. You cannot pause while it is in this mode. You cannot actually hurt Apocalypse Bird himself. Upon the destruction of the eggs, it will pop up on the screen a message. Far-sighted eyes of Big Bird have been blinded and will have effects. So we can now put everybody who is in there onto a different task. So this is the egg over here. It is red damage. This egg right here, I believe, is what pauses, prevents you from pausing the game. And there will be abnormalities that proceed to get a quilt counter on them from Apocalypse Bird himself. Little Bird's mouth that devours everything has been shut. So we have another egg destroyed. The last egg is up here. Upon the final egg, a head that looked up on the cosmos has been lowered. Three birds now as one looked onto the find the monster couldn't find it. There were no creatures, no sun, no moon, no monster. All that was left was a bird in a black forest. Once is defeated, you then have to deal with the ramifications of everything that happened by taking it out. But every person that took out Apocalypse Bird gets a gift on their back. HP plus 7, SP plus 7, work result rate plus 7, Work speed plus 7, movement speed plus 7, and attack speed plus 7. They withstood the twilight and faced the dawn in the forest. Did the bird's twitter stop? And that is how you defeat Apocalypse Bird. The story of Apocalypse Bird. A bird that is known to come when the world is filled with sins. Many employees feared the advent of the bird. If we want to talk about this bird, we must tell the story of the Black Forest first. We must not forget that forest, once so beautiful and peaceful. An apocalypse shall come after that. Tales from the Black Forest A long time ago, in a warm and dense forest, lived three happy birds. The birds had no names, but creatures in the forest called them Big Bird, Long Bird, and Little Bird. Everyone lived freely and happily together in the forest in peace. The birds wanted the forest to be safe more than anyone, so creatures from outside can come and visit and have fun. 
It was a warm and sunny afternoon when a stranger visited the peaceful forest. He was a traveler, pioneer, and prophet, but at the same time, he was nothing. He wanted to come into the forest, but the birds didn't let him because they found him suspicious. The stranger, angered, told the birds as he left. Tragedies will come to this forest soon. It will be tainted with sin and evil, and fights will never stop. Tragedies will stop once a terrible monster devours everything. The sun and moon will shine upon you no longer. The forest will never go back to what it was before. The birds became worried because of this prophecy. What if fights never stop and a terrible monster devours everything, as he said? The birds decided to become sentinels of the forest. They loved this forest, so they wanted to protect the creatures living in it and keep the peace. Big Bird, with his many eyes, watched over the forest to seek trespassers. Big Bird's eyes can see very far and things we can't see. Then somebody said, but what should we do if the monster comes in at night when everyone's asleep? Big Bird became worried, so he burned all his feathers to make an everlasting lantern. Now creatures in the forest were under Big Bird's watch day and night. Longbird weighed the sins of creatures that entered the forest to keep peace. Longbird's scales could measure every sin, and were fair and just. Then somebody said, but what should we do if the scales don't tip to any direction? Longbird became worried. So he made scales that tip only one direction so he could get the result under any situation. Little Bird decided to punish bad creatures with his beak. Then somebody said, but your beak is so small no one would find it painful. Little Bird became worried, so he split his mouth to make it big enough to devour any creature in one bite. No one wanted to visit the forest anymore. Bad rumors about the forest started spreading outside. Whoever enters the forest ends up in a terrible situation. No creature is free because Big Bird is watching them all the time. Longbird's scales are not fair at all. Little Bird's punishment is so scary. The birds were angry. Why would they spread rumors like that when they were working hard to protect the forest? Fewer and vis fewer visitors came to the forest. Creatures were complaining. Fights broke out daily. And the birds worked even harder to make the forest beautiful again. This forest is too big and wide to protect with only three of us. But there is no creature who can protect this forest but us. If we can merge our strength together, we might become stronger. The day be when Big Bird's eyes that see hundreds of kilometers away, Longbird, who can judge any sin, and Little Bird's mouth that can devour everything, merged together, darkness fell upon the forest. Creatures screamed in fear at the sight of the bird. The forest fell into chaos soon. In chaotic cries of fear, somebody shouted, It's the monster! Big, terrible monster lives in dark, black forest. Monster? Three birds, now as one, looked around to find the monster, but couldn't find it. The birds started looking for the monster, wandering the forest. It's dangerous as if the monster is in the forest. But there was nothing. There were no creatures, no sun and moon, and no monster. All that is left is just a bird, and the black forest. Only cold, dark night continued from then. Rumors say that a terrible monster in the Black Forest where no one lives. Testimony of a Survivor Every single light in the facility went crazy. They kept going on and off. I couldn't even use a lighter. Then, warm light shone through. It looked like waning twilight, a rising morning sun. But as we know, sunlight can't come into the facility. We silently gazed at the light. A sudden darkness and weird gleam of light were enough reason to be frightened. It was scarier than any gory scene we saw here. It was a fear of unknown itself omitted. Something was coming from afar. Incandescent lights like stars in the space were walking towards us. It looked like Big Bird's eyes, but it was not him. I heard those long arms scratching the floor. Someone whispered, there's someone who couldn't run away. There was an employee kneeling on the floor, as if he couldn't sense the thing approaching from behind. He couldn't scream. He was just meaninglessly struggling to move his legs. There was no heroic act of another employee standing against the monster or even a scream that tells him to watch out. Everyone was just looking at him, expecting the terrible thing that was about to happen. Every step sent tremor to the whole facility. The monster was walking at a very slow pace, but it seemed so fast. It devoured the employee in one bite in that moment. Everyone started screaming in chaos. I succeeded in numerous suppressions. But that day, for the first time, I regret ever joining the company. I was sure that I wouldn't get out of here alive. This helplessness overwhelmed me. I couldn't even think about suppressing the monster. I think I'm the only one who is intact enough to write among the survivors. The company will never tell new employees about the presence of that monster. But I want to warn them. That's why I'm writing this.
So you can get this once you actually defeat him, or when Apocalypse Bird shows up, it gives you the story by clicking on one of the abnormalities, one of the three birds. The big eyes can find the light. The long arms hid the time. Small beak whispered endlessly. As long as they exist, the Apocalypse Bird will not disappear. It says that there's work instinct and all these things you can do on it. I don't know why this is here. The weapon and the armor are phenomenal. Like, they are some of the best that you can get. 0 0.3, 0 0.3, 0 0.3, 0 0.5. The weapon, the employees with fortitude, prudence, temperance, and justice above 110 can equip. Attack by all types. So it does red, white, black, and pale. Attack with special attack pattern at regular intervals. If there is an employee wearing this equipment, Apocalypse Bird does not appear. Eyes that never close, a scale that could measure all sins, and beak that could swallow everything protected in the black forest in peace. And those who could wield this could also bring peace. The suit, the lower the HP of an employee with that weapon, the greater the damage. If target stays in the same place for more than five seconds, take black damage every five seconds. Effect of the equipping all ego of the apocalypse bird. The damage type of the special ability is extended to red, white, black, and pale. If there is an employee wearing the equipment, Apocalypse Bird does not appear. Efforts of three birds to defeat the beast became one. It could stop countless incidents, but you'd have to be prepared to step into the Black Forest. And that has been Apocalypse Bird. Until next time.